Hi everyone, we're going to discuss this graph and answer some questions just to get to know the graph. So basically, the first question's here, and it says, is F, this is graph F, is F increasing on the interval negative 8 to negative 2? And what they're talking about is your X, because it's talking about an interval. This is not a point. So here's your X, negative 8, and negative 2 is right here. So if I look at the graph where it goes down to negative 8, we're at negative 4 here, it is increasing. So that's a yes. Now, is number uh, 2, is increasing on the interval 2 to 10? So here's 2, and here's 10. So when you go up to here, no, it's not. It's decreasing, and it's only increasing. Um, so that's a no. It's increasing, however, on the interval of 5 to 10. So you're looking at your x values. All right? So let's look at some more. It says, where, list the intervals on which f is increasing. So let's read the graph from left to right. We already know it's increasing, and you're looking at your x values from negative 8 to negative 2. We already did these two. All right, it's also increasing from 0 to 2 right here. And what else? And also 5 to infinity. All right. Um, so we did that. Is there a local minimum at x equals 2? If Yes, what is it? So there is a local minimum at x equals 2. So this is a yes. And what is it? It's your y value. So it's 10. List the numbers in which uh, x has a, that's supposed to be maximum, sorry, local maximum. What are these local maximums? So local maximum just means um, your top ones here. So basically, we have a maximum at negative 2 and 2, at x equals negative 2 and x equals 2. So you look at the x, and it says, uh, what are these? So what they are is the one that goes with negative 2 is 6, and the one that goes with 2, we already did, is 10. All right? Now let's look at this one. It says, is f increasing on negative 8 to negative 2? So here's negative, um, oh, that's the same one. Let's move on. Is f increase, decreasing on the interval negative 8 to negative 4? So where's negative 4? Right here. Um, no, it's increasing. All right, so you can probably do this. Is it decreasing on the interval 2 to 5? So right there, 2 to 5, yes. List the intervals on which f is decreasing. So... Let's look at where it's decreasing. So we start left to right. So it's decreasing here. That's negative infinity to negative 8. It's decreasing here, negative 2 to 0. And it's also decreasing from, um, let's see, where are we, 10? to 5. I mean 2 to 5. All right. Now, it says, is there a local maximum at 5? So let's look at 5. No. It's a local minimum. Here's your local minimums right here. This is a local minimum at uh, x equals 5, and the value is 0. Okay? Um, list the numbers at which f has a local minimum. So list the numbers at which it has a local minimum. Then what is the local minimum? 
So the local minimum, sorry, in purple here, so it's at negative 8, x equals negative 8, x equals 0, and x equals 5. And what are, what are these local minimums is your y value. So it's negative 4, 0, and 0. So we're going to write negative 4, 0, and 0. Okay? Um, if this is a local minimum here. All right. That's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.